Okay? Hi, I'm Bob Rogash from www.freehawaii.org. It's a, it's a website that you should look at and get uh, the, what the issues are here in Hawaii. Huh? A lot's been taken off because there's people come in and change it. But what I'm here today to talk about is statehood 50th anniversary. That is the most heinous anniversary there ever is. The whole thing of them occupying Hawaii, coming in. The United States Marines came and overtook the thing. Of course, they did it with the Universal Church of Christ, so it's a Christian thing too, you know. All Christians have to deal with this. If you believe in, in Jesus Christ, well, then you know that you have to give back Hawaii because you are just as guilty as every German citizen when they said they were just doing their job. It's the duty of every citizen to question whether the agency of their government is working with the bounds of their authority. There is no agency in Hawaii that works with the bounds of their authority because they have no bounds. They're, the United Nations in 1960 said that statehood did not meet the burden of self-determination. It only gave statehood or territory, so therefore it's invalid. But who cares about here because you know, we like to go to the beach. We like to go to here. We like there. We like to go to the mountain. We like to, we have businesses here. We can sell land. What land? You know, in 19, 1983, all the land was a lodial title. Today, the land has been given back to a lodial title. But the occupiers who are here are the same as the South Africa. You can look at South Africa and say, they're the same thing. The white supremacy so is here, and it may be a little dark on one side or the other, but they're, they love to steal. They love to take from others because they think they could do it better. I think they think that God gave them the right to take it because they could do it with it better, huh? But it's just wrong. And I know I get excited like this because I don't know how else to do it, you know? How else can you look at people and say, Oh, this is my place. I bought this place. I own this place. You don't own nothing. You're nothing but a thief. Every, every realtor, every realtor is a thief. Every developer should be, boom, gone. And, and look at the developers, what they've done to this place. They're trying to take this place over there. Of course, it's with the governor or maybe the mayor, the old mayor. Now she's the governor. Still doing the same thing. It is a rotten core. And it should just come, and every person who thinks, who has any self-respect should say, give it back. Give it back. And there is a person to give it back. It's a kingdom of wise, sovereign nation of God. They already have all the land, all, all the land. It was given to them by the state. But the state doesn't look at it that way. They look at, oh, well, that doesn't make any difference. We'll just do what we want to do. You know? Oh, we'll push more kanakamoles off. They, they don't care. They can live on the beach. We can take the bulldozer and bulldoze them over. You know, it's really, really rotten. And I hope, I may turn some people off with this, but I hope every person who has had the ability to take and people run them off their land, I hope you run off your land, but not this land, because you, this is not your land. You're going to have to go back to America. And what's America? America is nothing but stolen too. What is America? America is nothing more than a bunch of thieves. All they have been. They steal from everybody. But I'm talking about Hawaii right now. The Kanakamoles, huh? Not Hawaiians. The Kanakamoles. They're the original people. And they would do anything for you. But do you think that we're going to do anything for them? Heck no. They're dumb. They're when the queen went to the, to the United States Capitol... She wasn't allowed in the White House because she was black. They didn't call her black. They called her nigger. That's what they called her. That's what they're still doing. The disrespect for all the people here is totally un... I can't think of the adjective to do it. But I know this much, that it is about time to give it back. And thank you very much, Akaku. And I hope you stay here forever. Bye.